Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. So in this one, we're going to be taking a look at a Shopify store called Primal Derm that is currently for sale on flipper.com for 95,000 US dollars. In this video, we're going to be jumping into the computer, jumping into the listing, having a full breakdown of this store. So we'll be taking a look at the Shopify store design itself, their best selling product, their ads they've used to generate over $1.6 million in revenue, and ultimately taking a look at whether this store is worth the asking price. As always though, I love to get your guys' opinion. Once you've watched the video and you've seen all of the information for yourself, make sure you leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. If you had the money, would you pay 95 grand for this Shopify store? So let's jump straight into it. This company is called Primal Derm. They've been in business for two and a half years. It's an e-commerce brand in the beauty industry, earning over $1.6 million in revenue, which is an average of 8,000 US dollars of average monthly profit for the last 12 months. So give or take, what's that, $96,000 profit a year. We'll take a look at the images which come with the listing. What is really interesting is of all the store reviews I've done, this is the first one which shows you their feedback score on Facebook. This is key and imperative to your success if you want to run Facebook ads. Ultimately, what this score means is it's a reflection of how well your business, your products, essentially your brand is received on Facebook. And if your customers' expectations are met and you have a high feedback score, this can greatly benefit the results of your Facebook ads. If you have a poor feedback score, ultimately it can lead to getting banned, but in the meantime, it will lead to higher ad costs. Let's take a look at the next image, which is this snapshot of sales since May 2020. A couple of things to point out here. Number one, one and a half million in turnover, which isn't bad at all. And number two is this is February of 2023. We can clearly see this product is still selling. So if you're watching this video and this product speaks to you, then it may be something that you want to pursue yourself. The proof is in the pudding here. It's a proven concept and it works. Okay, so some bullet information. Total sales of 1.57 million, which we've just seen a total profit so this is since they started two and a half years ago of over 235k so it's averaging about 100k a year which isn't too bad at all total sales for the last 12 months was still over half a million with a total profit as i worked out earlier um, of just over 90k I have an average order value of 53 dollars that's an important number to keep in mind once we take a look at their best-selling product 30,000 orders 90,000 sessions 64,000 plus customer info that alone is worth a lot of money but what's worth even more money is a season pixel. That will be a Facebook pixel with over three quarters of a million dollars in ad spend. What a lot of beginners fail to recognize or fail to understand when you start Facebook ads, think of it as like a domino effect. You're starting at the very beginning with the tiniest of dominoes and with every dollar spent, the domino gets slightly bigger and bigger and bigger. In the beginning, the results and the return you get on your Facebook ads will be the worst it ever will be. The Facebook pixel learns, it builds up a profile of who the types of people are that are interested in your product. So in the beginning with no past data, it has zero information. And with every dollar spent, with every impression gained, with every ad link clicked, Facebook will start to learn. So ultimately, the more money you put through your pixel, the better and more efficient it will be at targeting those people who are gonna buy your product. As for the operations, 95% of the process is automated. Customer support handles all of the emails, refunds, and chargebacks and is in contact with the supplier when any problems occur, which is approximately seven hours a week. Not a bad return considering it's making nearly a hundred grand a year in profit. That's just for his team though. If we have a look at what he's doing himself, he mainly keeps track of the financials, which is typical. Unless you get to proper big numbers, then you're probably just gonna do this yourself or have your accountant do it. Uh, manage other employees, deal with spontaneous problems, pay employees, supplier, manage Facebook ads. In the last three months, he's been spending approximately 30 minutes per day. So what's that? Two and a half hours a week or three and a half hours a week if you count in the weekend. So again, so again, not a bad return on your time whatsoever. What's key to any successful dropshipping business when it comes to sustainability is having a reliable supplier. Think of your supplier as like your best friend in business. It's so important and crucial to your success. So he's worked with plenty of suppliers in the past and the current one is the best by far. Doesn't pay him immediately. He pays him after four to $5,000 of goods has been sold, which helps his cash flow. Between them, they're always looking for the fastest shipping lines and currently they can send five to 10 business days to 40 plus countries worldwide. And we even send two to four days to the EU and New Zealand. 
That is so important and imperative to your success. As soon as you have a bit of traction with any particular supplier, then you should be looking to double down on that relationship. And if they can't give you something similar, or at least are willing to work with you to achieve better shipping times, a higher quality product, then you should be looking elsewhere. Their customer base is 30 countries worldwide. Most of the sales coming from the US around 60%, Canada 15, Arab Emirates 10% and United Kingdom around 10%. So there's definitely some scope there to be branching out and spending more money and being more successful in those countries. So if you're watching this in Australia, for example, there may be an opportunity for you in the UK, for example, this is a proven concept. And he even tells us who the ideal demographics are, which is 18 to 45. And this is more profitable than the 45 plus. Before we jump into the Shopify store, then we'll take a quick snapshot of the last 12 months. As we can see, pretty consistent. In March 22, they did 50K and in in February of 23, so last month, they did nearly 70K. This is a product which is selling well and selling profitably. Now you have a proof of concept watching this video. So if this is the sort of thing that speaks to you and excites you, then perhaps you wanna try and replicate this business in your own country. Okay, so let's jump straight into their product page. This is their best selling product. This is the product page that their Facebook ads are linking to. Not to take anything away from this store, but this is a very basic looking design, a very basic look in Shopify store. The theme they're using is the about Lou, so some sort of custom theme. However, it looks like pretty much any other default theme, maybe even like a debutify theme. So it just goes to show, just to re-emphasize the emphasis on social proof. Social proof is what sells this product. Number one is they have a branded box with the logo on. I'm not 100% sure if it actually comes in this box, but what I am gonna say is to create an, inf an infographic, to create a graphic like this, to give off the impression your product comes in a branded box is super easy to do. Check out our website called placeit.net. For £15, you can create unlimited templates and mock-ups just like this one. As we move down the product page, the theme becomes apparent. It's all about social proof. They have a real person here demonstrating how to use the product, followed by reviews. They have another person demonstrating how to use the product. They have more and more people showing the before and after results of the product. And they also have this custom animations created to demonstrate how the product works. Now, to be honest, to be 100% honest and transparent upfront with you guys, I would usually stay away from products like this. And when I was doing my research into it, I, I was um and ahhing. I was on the fence about whether I wanted to speak about this business because it is one of those kind of health-related before and after type of products. But everything I've seen from this listing and from the comments from their customers and the Facebook feedback scores and the fact that it's still selling today, you can only build a business of this size and have those feedback ratings if customers are actually happy with the product. Moving down, there's more social proof. So they actually have some screenshots from Facebook customers. So this is what I was just mentioning. Bought this a year ago. It's the best thing ever. Bought this and really happy with it. Love, love, love mine. Got mine yesterday. Love it. So there is genuine people by the looks of it. They're actually happy with this product. The fact that they've got that 4.2 feedback score on Facebook is where we're after spending nearly a million dollars. Just goes to show people are genuinely happy with their purchase. So they're selling this product. Let's take a look at numbers. They're selling this product for 60 pounds, which is what? $70. And there's a a few different I mean I might be butchering this but the only difference to me there is the colors whether that makes a difference to the treatment um, I don't know so all in all about $70 this is one supplier I found on Aliexpress which is selling it for $15 to delivered so there's a very healthy profit margin just to scroll through and show you, you do get all the same kind of components and that sort of thing there's the two different colors in fact let's take a look so argon is harmless gas neon is harmless gas uh, so the argon is for acne prone skin and the neon is for aging skin. So there'll be the two different applications. Back to the numbers then. So $15 delivered versus $70 selling price. That leaves a pretty healthy profit margin of in and around $50. Let's jump into the Facebook ads library then. We've just seen they're still active. They're still making sales in February 23. Um, so let's take a look at the kind of um, Facebook ads that they're running and see if there's like a common theme. So. Both of these ads here launched in March of this month, a couple of days ago, still active. Stats go straight into a quotation, a testimonial from Susie. Both ad creatives are a thumbnail of somebody using the product, demonstrating it, a real person, an influencer, an actor, whoever it may be. These ads launched in February. Again, it's the same Susie testimonial. They've obviously split tested this and found that it works. Let's jump into the specifics though. Let's take a look at this ad creative here. 
So in case you missed it, the thumbnail was a snapshot of lots of different testimonials. Um, straight away, it kind of starts with some zapping noises, which is quite scary, actually. I think it actually highlighted that at the beginning. But then it goes into lots of different people demonstrating how the product works, talking about the product, showing different kind of before and after effects. It gives off that impression that lots of people have tried and tested this product. And there's kind of like after watching this, there'd be no kind of um, what's the word I'm looking for? No doubt that the product actually works, plus all the social proof. It does a really good job of convincing somebody to buy the product. If we have a look at the other ad creative they're running, so again, the same kind of theme with the zaps and the electro noises. I highly recommend going and checking these ad creatives out actually, because they've been put together really nicely. So straight away, it will show the different applications. It shows somebody who obviously has a requirement for this product. It shows a slight kind of snapshot of the science of how it works. It shows an after effect. It shows lots of different people using it has a pretty cool that was pretty cool and also quite scary actually but um, just goes to show people are willing to do anything when it comes to looking good um, regardless of what the product is but like I said everything goes back to the whole positivity behind this brand the comments from people on Facebook their feedback score it must be a product that has benefits to it because people at the end of the day um, are happy with it just to show you their socials quickly as well there's a post here and somebody's asked 17 weeks ago has anyone tried this and somebody's commented saying yes it's good I recommend it it's a bit scary at first but you need to learn how to use it it works wonders let's just check this person out and see if they're real so they've got 120 friends a couple of posts they're profile may be private so for all intensive purposes it probably is a real person that somebody is actually generally happy with the product so it must work it must do what they claim otherwise they wouldn't have all those positive comments and great feedback scores and so with that being said then guys i'm going to wrap the video up um, i hope you enjoyed it let me know in the comment section below it turns over eight to nine grand profit every single month would you pay if you had the money ninety thousand dollars for this business let me know in the comment section below thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one